Hello and welcome to Southbridge. So today I will show you how to create a countdown timer with flip animation effect. So before we start to code, uh, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and please click the notification bell to, to get updated from my latest videos. So I have here a basic HTML template. So the head and the body tags so now I will use this flip down JavaScript library so I will put the link in the description box to use this library we just download the zip file and then from this master folder we will go to dist and then we will copy this flip down that mean that js and flip down that mean that css so let's copy this and let us paste this in our project folder so countdown dash flip so paste and then i will go back to the code editor so the first thing we wanna do is uh, we have to uh, link our style sheet from flip down and the JavaScript file. So link uh, flip down that mean that CSS. And then we will reference the JavaScript. Script source uh, flip down that mean that JS. And then I will put our title tag. So title is countdown timer with flip animation. So next is we have to create a div element. So it will serve as a container for our countdown timer. So I will put an ID. Uh, I will just put a uh, flip down. And then I will put the same in the class. So flip down and then uh, I will put some heading. So let me just type uh, coming soon. So now we can uh, use the library. To use the library, we have to create a new object from our flip down that mean that js. So new flip down, and then it will get some parameters. So the first parameter is uh, Unix timestamp. Let me just go to the uh, time stop conversion tool so I will put the link in the description so that you can also use this website and so what I will do is I want to get this type of timestamp so in order to convert this we have to put our desired uh, date for our countdown timer so I will just choose uh, December 12 in the midnight. So 12 zero, zero, and then zero, zero, a.m. And then uh, just click this human date to timestamp. So I will copy this timestamp, the first one. So copy and we can now use this as a parameter in our flip down object. So the next parameter will provide is the options. And the options I will put is the theme. So uh, let me just type uh, theme is equal to uh, dark. And then we have a start method. 
so let us try to view this in our browser so as you can see our countdown timer will start immediately because of the start method so uh, today is November 12 and it says 29 days and 14 hours and 36 minutes to December 12, 2020 that's how you can use this but I will add some functionality so that we can execute some logic or some code when our countdown timer stops to count. To do that, we can use the if ended method. So I will just uh, append this method to the start method. So if ended, then uh, I will provide a callback function so, so in this example I will use the arrow function so if ended then I will display a message the countdown has ended so as of now, uh, we cannot see this in our console because our countdown timer has 29 days left. The time here in our country is 5.25 p.m. So I will convert a Unix timestamp into, I think, uh, 5.28 p.m. So let's go back to the website. So... November uh, November 12 and then uh, 5 uh, let me just use 29 29 minutes p.m. okay local time so let's copy this converted Unix timestamp So, put this in the first parameter and then we'll try to check in our browser. So, it has 2 minutes. So, we will see if it displays a message in the console if it runs out of time. So, we have now 20 seconds left in our timer. So, let's see. zero okay as you can see it displays the countdown has ended so you can use this event to remove the countdown container so I, I will now put a style in our countdown timer so actually these codes are not necessary but it helps us use the light theme in our flip down library so uh, let's type light okay and let's view again so that is how to create a countdown timer with flip animation effect in javascript so if you like the video please click the like button and please subscribe to my channel